Evan, you're still in my thunder. Yes, it <laughs> is going to be a hot Saturday, and today is going to be a gorgeous evening. Clear skies continue to take shape all across the South Plains, but that is not the case everywhere. We obviously had a cold front push its way through overnight. Some of us seeing rainfall, other of us just dealing with those high wind speeds. Now the cold front has pushed its way off towards the Dallas Fort Worth area, causing many delays and obviously a lot of torrentious rainfall causing some flash flooding and they even did have a tornado very close to DFW. Of course, we've got all the details on everything Lubbock.com and on our Facebook pages. So continue to think about these guys because they are dealing with a lot of weather and getting a little aggravated. Several flights have been delayed or even canceled, not only in the Dallas area, but also in the hub city, but thankfully we're not dealing with any of that severe weather. We're just dealing with some warm conditions. Take a look at the temperatures right now. We're coming in at 82 degrees in the hub, 88 over into Abilene, 92 in San Angelo and in the immediate zones. We do have those temperatures flirting right around the 90 degree mark along into the rolling plains. Along the state line, we are slightly cooler coming in in the mid to even upper 70s. Winds continue to hold on. They're coming in out of the southwest, sustained around 25 to even 30 miles per hour at times, such as up towards the north in Friona. These winds are going to stick around for another one to two hours, then they will begin to die down. Tomorrow, we'll see a little breeze, but nothing compared to what we will deal with this weekend. But all in all, what we will see for the next several We'll have the winds and clear skies. A lot of sunshine all across the South Plains, really helping those temperatures continue to climb. And that's going to aid in our warming trend. Tomorrow is the first day of the warming trend. Those temperatures will rebound close to 90 degrees by the afternoon. We head into Saturday. Breezy conditions will persist, being around 25 to 30 miles per hour. And we are looking for those temperatures to get in the mid 90s. Off into the rolling plains, we will be at or surpassing the triple digit mark. The winds continue on into our Mother's Day weekend. Sunday temperatures will get up to 91 degrees. Winds will shift from breezy to windy, meaning we'll, we'll be around 35 to 40 miles per hour sustained in the latter portion of the day. But as far as church attire is concerned, no skirt alert in the morning. Guys, 